Hi, this is Alan from Max Foundry here to, to demonstrate more about working with files with Media Library Folders Pro for S3. If you need to download a file, you can do so simply by selecting it and clicking the Download from S3 button. It will ask you if you're sure, then it will download it. And all of its thumbnail images. And when it's done, you'll see that it's changed the color of the title to red, and that tells you that it's down on the server and on the local server and not on the S3 anymore. And we can take it back up to S3 simply by clicking Update Upload to S3. And now the color is back to black, indicating that it's on S3. We can also sync files. So if you're if you upload uh, images to your uh, local server by FTP, then you can add them to your media library by clicking the sync button. So let's see what it can find. It found two files, so it will generate the thumbnails and upload everything to S3. And so here we have one image, and it's been uploaded to S3, and then we have another image. So uh, with that, you're able to upload images without having to, uh, you can upload images in bulk, rather than having to upload them one at a time. So that's what else you can do with Media Library Folders Pro S3.